Welcome to the vlog. It is currently 7.38 in the freaking morning. I am awake, I am up, I am ready. I have to go pick up one of my friends. Um, Cause today we're road tripping to Trader Joe's. I'm very excited. I haven't been to Trader Joe's in a while. I think the last time I was at Trader Joe's, I took you guys with me and Audrey came with me as well. And that was like Christmas time. But I'm gonna stop and get Duncan first. I was gonna get a chai from Duncan, but I was like, I'll make my own. Made my own. It's all right. But I need food, so I'm gonna go to Duncan and then pick her up. But I have to call her first to see if she's even awake. And then I have to go to my work, do my friend's hair, and then we're off to Trader Joe's. Busy day. Cat's at my mom's cat, so I thought I'll take you guys along with me. I'm gonna go get Duncan. I'll see you guys in a little bit, see if she answers, but I'm gonna get this show on the road because we're on a time crunch right now, so I'll see you guys in a little bit. I'm home. Alright, I'm home, so I'm going to show you guys what I got. I have a lot. Literally spent more time driving than actually in there. So let's start with refrigerator stuff. I got this crunchy salad. Thought that'd be good. I got a lot of freezer stuff, so I'm hoping to God this all fits in my freezer. Two things of fried raviolis. Um, I got a gnocchi with tomato sauce, cauliflower and yolky, so I see like everyone eat these, so I thought, you know what, it sounds really good. And I got regular traditional and yolky and cheese. And then I got my usual of orange chicken, I got two of them because they are amazing. And along with that, I usually get vegetable fried rice, so I got spinach dip which sounded really good and Dakota really likes spin dip so get that and I also got this buffalo style chicken dip it's pretty good and everyone raves about these which is the mini hold the cone ice cream cones so I thought you know what why not these vegan cookies and cream vanilla bonbons I just thought it sounded good. And I got this Spanakopita, but like in a pie. I usually get like the pastry one, so I was like, it's a pie, might as well try it. All right. I got some organic air pop popcorn. Give that a whirl. I didn't get many snacks because usually snacks, I usually shop for Dakota. So, we'll go somewhere else for that. However, I did get these milk chocolate covered peanut butter pretzels. I need to try them now. That's delicious. Another thing for the freezer, I got this burrata, prosciutto, and arugula flatbread. Sounded good. Got some more kombucha because they were really cheap there. So I got strawberry lemonade to try, watermelon wonder, Gingerade. I also got these really gross shots, but I see everyone take them, so I wanted to try them. You know. And I always see these vegan, well, 
these dressings and well yeah they're both vegan i really wanted to try them so i got spicy cashew butter dressing and then vegan caesar dressing they both sounded really good so and i can reuse the bottles and i got this cajun style alfredo sauce like okay okay and i got vodka sauce oh and um an oil oil spray the last bag veggie crisps my favorite this intrigued me they're giant peruvian inca corn i was like mm, that's different try that whole thing of ciabatta bread because it's like a dollar 99 for this whole thing of ciabatta bread i got sesame sticks because they're bomb tortillas flat bread um this you never know how to pronounce it, but this type of bread. Probably I'm going to have this later. It's my favorite bread and I haven't gotten it in a long time. And lastly, I got this three seed sweet potato crackers. So, this was everything and I'm going to now put it away. So I'll just kind of zoom past this part. You guys can watch me put everything away. <laughs> so I made it to my mom's house. I'm filming on my phone now because I left my camera at my house because it just wasn't it, wasn't it? Um, but I made it to my mom's house. I am feeding her cat and I am making myself a little bit of a snack. I'm having just toast with cream cheese. I'm probably gonna chill here for a little bit. I don't I don't know if I wanna go out and do things. I kinda wanna go to Hobby Lobby just to see what they have because I haven't been there in a hot minute. And then I might go to Target and get Dakota like snacks for the house. I mean, he's got like a shit ton of popcorn, but sometimes I don't wanna eat popcorn, you know? And then I'm just gonna chill here for a little bit. And I'll catch you guys in a little bit. <laughs> Hi, I'm home now after going to my mom's house and I decided to go to Hobby Lobby. As you guys saw, they had like all their Christmas stuff out, which was very strange. It's, it's June, but anyway, I want to show you guys what I got. So I went down the clearance aisle and I really wish I got the other one so I can buy a print and put a print in this. But anyway, I might go back tomorrow because I have to go to my mom's. I found this on clearance in perfect condition. Absolute perfect condition. It was $10.99, $9.99. I got from $10. That was still a steal when it's originally $40. Bucks. So I got that. And then they had 50% off all their spring stuff. And they had a bunch of... Uh, like storage containers so i decided to buy a bunch so i got quite a bit and also the lady that i went to all her little papers had notes on them let me show you guys what i got but i got a bunch of new storage containers so i got three of like the rectangular ones so i got one of each size i think i got one of each size and then I got three of the circle ones. And I thought that was a really good deal because they are glass, they have a wooden top, so aesthetically pleasing, and they're suction cup like lids. So, highly recommend going to Hobby Lobby, finding these. 
Some of them are very hard to open, so I'm gonna try my best to open some of these because I need to clean them and get the silica packets out of them. So let me do that and clean up my mess. All right, cracked myself open a smeared off. I'm tired. I've been running around literally all freaking day. I want to get out of these jeans. And then I'm probably just going to relax for a little bit because, like I said, I've been running around all day. I want to have actual food in my system because I literally have just been having, like, snacks all day. I'm going to go do that. I'm going to go change. But there's not much to do on this Monday. Like, I did all my chores. Like, I just have to do laundry. And I'm done. I'm done, guys. She's did a lot of running around. Me yesterday was very smart and was like, let's do all her chores today. So I'm very glad I did because, I mean, I just have to put this laundry away and then put my other laundry away. That's okay. So I'm going to change though and go relax for a little bit and I'll, I'll catch you guys a little bit in a little bit. I kind of wanted to go back out because I wanted to go to Weiss and get like fruit and stuff because I don't have, like bananas or strawberries, grapes. kind of want to get fruit, but um, looks like I'm not <coughs> Looks like I'm not going out there anytime soon. Oh my god. <laughs> if it's gonna storm, please storm. Don't just be cloudy and be windy. Like, you guys, can you see how windy it is? It's insane. But while this. Oh, I like the hiccups. This storm's brewing. I thought it's only necessary to go finish the rest of my chores. So, I'm going to finish my laundry because I have all of this to put away. This still needs to be put away, but I don't feel like cleaning out my other room yet um, for the simple fact that my friends might use it to sleep in. So, yeah, and I'm really hoping a tree branch doesn't fall on my truck because it's very windy. Is it gonna rain? Is it gonna storm? I don't know. I live in PA, but I'm gonna put some clothes away, go down in the basement and get some clothes, but yeah, let's finish these chores. So I'm gonna end my vlog here for today because I'm gonna start back up tomorrow and film a week in my life. But before I go and end this vlog, I wanted to try the two things that I got from Trader Joe's. So let's restart that. I wanted to try the two like dessert ice cream things that I got. So the first thing I'm gonna try is the vegan cookies and cream vanilla bean bonbons. It's coconut non-dairy frozen dessert enrobed in a chocolatey Coating. I don't like coconut, but it intrigued me. So we're gonna try it. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Talk about fancy, first of all. Oh, they're huge. That's actually really good. It doesn't taste like coconut at all. It honestly tastes like cookies and cream. But I really enjoyed that. And one bonbon is only 110 calories, so. 10 out of 10 recommend. Super bougie packaging. I really like. And now it's time for the hold the cone ice cream cones. I know um, Catherine June raves about these. A couple other people. I can't. <laughs> She's the only one that I can remember that raves about them. So here they are. They're so tiny. Hope my boyfriend doesn't eat all these because he loves like ice cream cones. So let's try it. Now this is to die for. These are good. These are good. These are only 93 calories each, and a serving is three cones. So, 
that's really good if you're trying to lose weight and like you cat like calorie track track your calories 10 out of 10 recommend these and these bonbons they're pretty freaking big for only 110 calories i didn't even finish the one so these two definitely recommend but i'm gonna go ahead and end off the vlog here i hope you guys enjoyed my like trader joe's haul and you know my monday that i'm not doing the normal stuff that i do if you guys enjoyed give the video a thumbs up and while you're down there hit the subscribe button and stay around for a while i'll love to have you guys and i'll see you guys next week in my next video bye